Hello there, this is Michael Kinsler with the e-commerce shopping carts tutorials, $120, free hosting. And I'm moving on with the next tutorial after localization and geo zone. So we haven't uploaded any products yet. We haven't done anything yet. So basically we've just done PayPal, we've done the search engine optimization, and we're setting up this cart now. So when we go to add the products and categories, everything will just fall into place basically so we're going to move on now with the next thing so it's settings localization and we're going into tax classes so this would be the next one here taxable goods if there's nothing in there you just press insert and put in whatever it is taxable goods or whatever you want to do there Remember now, you'll get it probably with nothing in here. So you just insert and call it. So if I press insert, you'll actually see it. There it is there. So you can call it whatever you want. And then you just put in your rate. So I'll just cancel out of that. Now, because this one is already in here, we'll go to edit. See, it's very straightforward, the shopping cart. There's nothing major to it. So here we go. <coughs> We've got tax class title, so we're going to call it taxable goods. Description, taxed stuff. So you're selling in the shopping cart and the guy goes to buy it. So he sees this is $100, 100 euro. And then he goes to buy it. And then what happens is then he'll get an invoice with the tax added on to it. Okay, that's basically about the height of it in VAT. So now I'm going to add which one I did earlier on, which was the Irish tax goods. So I'm going to click on here. I'm going to put Irish VAT. And I'm going to put in VAT 21%. And that's it. And then you just basically come in here. 21.0000. Priority is one and then add tax rate. That's it. And if your tax rate goes up and down, like what happened in Ireland recently, we didn't know where we were what type what tax rate we were paying at one stage. In certain places in certain shopping carts, they'll actually if you're not in control of the actual website, web developers or web designers will actually charge you for changing this so basically now you've got your own CMS you know how to do it yourself so basically that's how fast it is save the changes and success you've now got if you look in here you've now got it in there and that's you done that's the I'm gonna cancel out of that <coughs> and that's you got your tax class set up you don't have to go back to it unless they change the tax in your country UK France Germany whatever it is that's all you need to do so then we'll move on with the next tutorial which probably depending on what you're setting up I'm looking at this uh, measurements okay and then the shipping details and then practically set up the manufacturers before we even start anything else okay thank you